Hey, so it's day seven of Game On. It's just this quick video series that I thought up last week and uh, it's been a week already. So basically I've been sharing quick little tips on how to stay strong um, while you got a whole lot of stuff on your plate. You're like, how am I gonna do this and not become a wreck? And that's basically what this video series is. So um, you can find the previous videos on YouTube at Brienne Curran, that's my channel, um, or on this Facebook page. So it's Burn Brighter Coaching, um, and that's the Facebook page, and you're gonna find lots of awesome tips to come in previous ones as well. So just quick little things that help keep you healthy and strong. That's basically what Burn Brighter is all about. Alrighty, so what I'm doing today is I'm making myself a um, breakfast casserole, right? And I love this, it's super, super simple. This is a recipe that I uh, resort to when your friend says, can you come over to brunch or can you bring something? And you're like, I don't wanna cook anything or I don't know what to do or whatever. So the cool thing is it's quick because all you do is throw a bunch of stuff into a slow cooker, into a crock pot, um, but you do need the crock pot time, right? So if you can make it like the night before and go to bed or whatever like that, then it's awesome. So. I am making this for myself for the upcoming week because I have a lot of body demands and I need to stay healthy. So basically I know the high protein and all the veg in this awesome dish is going to keep me working at my best. So I was like, you know what, I'm just going to make this whole thing up for myself and I'll have it basically probably every day for either lunch or dinner um, or breakfast, but it's an awesome one. So let's say you have a brunch to go to tomorrow, this is going to be rad for you, right? Or if you... Um, you know, you need something to just stock up on for your family or whatever. Anyhow, it's an awesome recipe. So basically, it's a crock pot um, breakfast casserole. That's what it is. So um, I already have in here, and I quickly just shred it up with a food processor. That's just sweet potato. So I have sweet potato in there. Okay. And then you just toss in veg. Now, it has been a busy week, and, uh, you know, wherever I can cut corners and still stay healthy, that's awesome for me. So I get pre-packed veg. These are from Trader Joe's. I just got carrot I'm going to put in there. I'm going to toss my broccoli in as well, right? You can do different variations. Um, and then, and that was just one large sweet potato there. Then I have a pound of partially cooked up ground beef. Doesn't have to be cooked up all the way because it's going in the crock pot. Um, I have half of a red onion diced up, right? I'm going to put that in there, okay? And then you just add your mix of the other goodness. So um, it is a casserole, so you have eggs, right? So there are um, 12 eggs in here, so a dozen eggs, and then a teaspoon of um, yellow mustard powder, or mustard powder, yellow mustard powder, and then um, a teaspoon of ground black pepper, uh, two teaspoons of pink Himalayan sea salt, and uh, half a cup of coconut milk, get the full fat, and half a cup of almond milk. So that's basically it. You just mix all this stuff in, the milks, the um, mustard, the pepper, and the salt, and then the meat, and then you have your onion, you have your veg, you can do a different veg assortment. I've even put like kale in there before. That actually worked out really, really well. Um, so that's it, and then I'm just gonna put it on low for eight hours. So there you go, that's gonna be my go-to healthy meal, probably my biggest meal each day, um, that's gonna help keep my protein up and get me tons of veg so I stay healthy and strong and I've got a great go-to. And you know what, it's pretty inexpensive too. So hope you love it and um, you know I'll come back to you tomorrow. Alrighty.